So Java Server Pages Directives. In this chapter, we will discuss directives in JSP. So these directives provide directions and instructions to the container, telling it how to handle certain aspects of the JSP processing. A JSP directive affects the overall structure of the servlet class. It usually has the form at the rate a directive attribute equal to value. Directives can have a number of attributes which you can list down as key value pairs and separated by commas. The blanks between at the rate a symbol and the directive name and between the last attribute and the closing are optional. There are three types of directive tag, directive and description. At the rate page defines page dependent attributes such as scripting language, error page and buffering requirements. In at the rate include includes a file during the translation phase. At the rate tag lib declares a tag library containing custom actions used in the page. JSV the page directive. So the page directive is used to provide instructions to the container. These instructions pertain to the current JSP page. You may code page directives anywhere in your JSP page. By convention, page directives are coded at the top of the JSP page. So the basic syntax of the page directive is at the rate page attribute equal to value. You can write the XML equivalent of the above syntax as JSP directive dot page attribute equal to value. So the table lists out the attributes associated with the page directive, attribute and purpose. Buffer specifies a buffering model for the output stream. Auto flush controls the behavior of the servlet output buffer. Content type defines the character encoding scheme. Error page defines the URL of another JSP that reports on Java unchecked runtime exceptions. Is error page indicates if this JSP page is a URL specified by another JSP page's error attribute. Error page attribute. Extends specifies a superclass that the generated servlet must extend. Import specifies a list of packages or classes for use in JSP as the Java import statement does for Java classes. Info defines a string that can be accessed with the servlet's get servlet info method. Is thread safe defines the threading model for the generated servlet. Language defines the programming language used in the JSP page. Session specifies whether or not the JSP page direct participates in HTTP sessions. ECL ignored specifies whether or not the EL expression within the JSP page will be ignored. E scripting enabled determines if the scripting elements are allowed for use.